Hi, can I get a iced vanilla chai tea with um, oat milk? And then you guys have any cheese danishes left? That will be all. Hello guys! Hi! It's been like, what, a year since I've seen you guys? Ah! I am literally so excited to be back on camera, you have no idea. I have been planning like crazy since I've been off. A lot has happened since I've last been on camera. First of all, we hit 100 subscribers. That's cool! Second of all, I'm still here. I told you guys I was gonna be moving. I never moved. Um, I'm still with my mom. I probably won't be moving out until next year now. I'm broke. I quit my job at Target. I no longer work there because of managerial issues. Basically, she was just a racist little... I can't cuss. She... Mm, she... I, I have some stories about her, bro. So if you guys want some story times, let me know in the comments down below if they're on. I don't know if they're on anymore. If not, DM me on Instagram at Jamaria Giovanni. Shameless plug. But today, we are doing something a little fun. A little fresh. A little funky. I'm kidding, no. Haley Fam did this video first. I got this idea from her. We are going to be doing a hot girl fall routine. School time is happening. You guys know I dropped out of school, but like, school time's happening for some people. And a lot of things are going on right now. Getting back on the workforce. People are like going back to the office and stuff. Hot girl summer vibes have been dying down. And I'm not okay with it. Okay, I'm not we, I'm not here with it. We need to keep the energy going. First start, Starbucks. Washington doesn't have any Dunkin' Donuts. Honestly, we'll go to somewhere else other than Starbucks, but honestly, Washington doesn't really have that many, like, options of, like, coffee places. At least where I am, we only have, like, Starbucks or, like, Gravity Coffee or, like, Cassie's Corner. That's really it. And honestly, I'm not a vibe with them either, so I go to Starbucks because, like, at least they make my chai tea. How I want them to make my chai tea. So, yeah, that was my order. You guys saw like, a little clip of it. I tried to get you guys up here so you guys could see me, like, at the window, but I couldn't in time by the time I got up to the window so you guys are on my seat so I feel bad about that I'm sorry I'll get better at my ankles I promise but yeah today we're going to do a little hot girl fall we're going to do a little, do a little routine how we stay in that vibe of being hot girls all year long because it's not just during the summer baby we hot all year round this is ice because it is still like 80 degrees here um which is really weird for washington because usually around august it goes by down to like 60. the heat waves have been like killing me so far so i got an iced chai tea vanilla oat milk thing and then i got a cheese danish because i'm basic i'm gonna enjoy this and i will see you guys when we get to the next place fine and curvy, but slightly dirty can find an hour i'm on the journey literally the vibes we need at this point in time for this video yes we do planet her Ooh. now slow drivers ruin the vibe we are at the next location guys um so we are here at barnes and nobles we are going to go get some used to be at summer books we're gonna get some fall books um so i like fantasy books i love avatar related anything well, Avatar last airman i'm probably gonna get an opera tattoo soon so should i should i not because i really want to get something avatar tattooed on me I am tough. Don't get me wrong. I'm not Katara. I might be a little tough in my in May. Maybe a hint of Azula in there, you know? Um But I wanna get that. I'm gonna go in, see if they have any like Avatar stuff. See if they have any like, you know, self-development books. I'm like trying to start my business that I really wanna do, but like I have no idea how to start it, you know? I hate when that happens. Like you know what you wanna do. You know what you wanna do! You know what you wanna do, you guys, but you have no idea how to do it like zero zero idea i bought photoshop that was my first step i guess to start it is buying photoshop um other than that i have no idea at all so that's that i'm gonna finish my drink before i go in there because i don't want to come back and have it all like you know watery and disgusting i do have a limit today of 70 dollars so it's probably gonna be like three books about three books yeah last time i said i had a limit i went in there and i saw the whole entire avatar the last airbender comic series that budget went out the window. Okay, we bought the whole thing. You guys have seen, if you guys have, have you guys seen my room? Have you guys seen the books in my room? I have like the little, little um, collection for Avatar series because I am obsessed with Avatar. And I'm not the new generation where they're just starting to watch the show again. Like, no baby, I was there when it came out, okay? I'm old. Oh yeah, that's another update. I turned 20. Last time you guys saw me, I was a teenager. Yeah, I'm 20 years old. I'm old. And I'm not okay with it. I wanted to take pictures, but I forgot my tripod at home. 
So we're gonna have to do like a makeshift situation and find something to do. Cause like this outfit's too cute not to take pictures. And I'm mad at myself that I didn't bring like my tripod. I would bring my tripod. I never leave my house without my tripod. The one time I actually like want it though. You know, you know that always happens. The one time I actually want it, you forget it. I'm about to start leaving it in my car cause like I don't really use it other than when I'm out taking pictures. We're gonna go inside. Do some shopping after I finish this. I'm probably gonna need to go to that after this because this thing always makes me have to go poop. Um, it's not coffee though, which I don't understand why it makes me have to go poop though. But I'm sorry, that's TMI. I'm so sorry. I'll see y'all in a little bit. I'm gonna stop talking now. We've been editing today, it was a good day, and I said goodbye to my editing and headed upstairs. I think I'm gonna buy like a Spanish learning book to like work on my shyness. I'm like, oh my god, there's someone there. That's so after me. So I spent $90 on this. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I should not be allowed to go into bookstores. <sighs> I tried, okay? I put two books back. So technically I would have spent more, but like I did better this time. All right, so I got Rich Dad, Poor Dad. I hate that they have plastic bags now. They used to have paper. I don't know why they changed. And then I got the Complete Spanish All-in-One Premium Second Edition Total Language Study Program. Just because I want to learn Spanish, like, full-heartedly. I really want to learn Spanish this time. I'm not going to give up on myself. I have the Compact Spanish Dictionary. Spanish English Dictionary. So, let's see. Stock room. Deposito. Deposito. Um, give me a word. Any word. Label. Etiqueta. Etiqueta. Tiqueta. So much time from pronouncing that wrong. Um, I probably am. I know I am. Okay. And then I got two things from my mom. One thing I'm probably gonna give her for her birthday, and another I'm gonna give her today. I'm not gonna show you guys what I got from my mom. I'll probably show you the one thing I'm gonna give her today when I give it to her. But the other thing for her birthday, I know she watches literally every single one of my videos. They lock themselves out their car. Yo. That's dead. Yo, how you do that? How you lock yourself out your car? I ain't never done that before. I don't roll the window down. Mm -mm, baby. That's not how that works. If it was that easy to roll your window down, you should get a new car. Okay. So I'm going to go head home, take my dog on another walk, second walk of the day. And I'm going to read and then journal a little bit. I have, I never, I don't, I'm not going to say that I journal. I don't journal. This is for the video. Okay. Because the journaling looks ecstatic. That's why I'm doing it. I don't journal. I don't journal. I'm not gonna journal. I don't journal. The f I tried it, bro. I tried it. You tried it. It don't work for me. It's not my type of tea. I'm gonna go read my book. Take notes on my book. In a journal, I guess. I do that. I take notes on my book. Because I like to go back. See what else I learned, you know. Take extra notes, you know. Time to go home. Thank you guys for coming to Barnes & Noble with me. Oh. Uh, Okay, I don't know if this is like hot girl style for you guys, but to me, like being a hot girl is just do what you want to do. This is how I feel like a hot girl. I learn more. I experience more. I look hot in my nice outfit, which I did not show you guys. How did I not show you my outfit? Okay, zoom me. Okay, I'm going zoom the outfit. My black jeans, my veins, white top, my Playboy necklace. A little chain. Look a little. Look a little. What's it called? Oh, you can't see me. Oh, you can't see me. Uh, uh, uh. Quirky. Look a little, you know. A little dangerous. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm kidding. I literally look nothing cute at all. But I decided it was a cute outfit for the day. Also, what was I saying before I got distracted and took my outfit? Oh, this is how I feel like a hot girl. This is how we, like everyone feels like a hot girl. Like my workout is like walk my dog. Mostly because. That's a different video. The whole reason why I honestly, not that I can't, I don't want to work out. I really do. I really want to do like workout programs and stuff. I just can't at this point in time in my life. Which I will go into in another video if you guys want that. I believe if you guys don't want that, I'm still going to do it. So I don't care. <laughs> Sorry. That was so mean. Okay. I'm going to go home for the fifth time. Oh, no. Wait. Wait. Music. You can't drive anywhere without music. I want to read a little bit and journal. I mean, write notes about the book that I'm reading. Um, so the book I'm reading right now isn't the one that I just got. It's actually Working Hard and Hardly Working by Grace Beverly. I got this like three months ago and I still haven't read it. I'm still on chapter freaking one. Actually, I'm not even on chapter one. I'm in the introduction. 
When I tell you I procrastinate, I'm literally on page four and I've started this whole book over it five times. I've had three months. Because I'm, I'm, so, I'm so weird. I can't like start things like in the middle. Like if I'm watching a TV show and I find out that, or like a movie and I find out there was a first one, I have to watch that first one or I will not watch any others. Like I can't like watch other movies. Even if you don't need to watch the other ones, I need to watch in order. Like Marvel Universe, Marvel Universe, Mar Marvel Universe. Like Marvel Universe, I've never seen like one movie. I probably saw like Thor, maybe Thor Ragnarok. I saw that one. Um, but like, I'm so weird. I have to watch them all in order. Like I'm waiting for all of, for them to be done making Marvel movies. Cause I think the end game one was like the last kind of one for now. And then they have like WandaVision and Loki and stuff like that going on. But since it like, it was kind of the last one, I'm now gonna watch them in order from like the very first, like in the timeline it goes. Not in how it came out, but in the timeline. Cause I'm weird like that. I have to watch it. Otherwise I'll get confused and I'll get a note. That was a tangent, I'm so sorry. But I'm gonna be reading this book, taking a few notes on it and just chilling out for the rest of the day. Um, I probably will come back later because we are gonna have a little oh, self-care time. A little hot girl self-care time. This is not really a hot girl fault. I'm so sorry. This is like sad girl fault. But I'm really trying here to be hot. It's so hard to be hot. But I'm working on it, you know. Say hi to the boomster. They all think they've seen you since like childhood. He got so big. He's so big now. Look at him. Uh, go play with your stick. Just finished reading a little bit. Um, no, I'm in bed. I'm trying to figure out how I want to make it because I switched the way it faces. So now all the pillows that I got to go against my wall don't go against my wall anymore. So I'm working on that. But I just finished reading a chapter of my book because my dog kept messing with me while I was trying to read. Cause he wanted scratches. He wanted scratches. Hello. Okay, so it's a little bit later. Um, and now it's just time. To do what we're supposed to do every night and do a little self care, no matter how you figure that. We're supposed to do self care every night, whether that's Netflix and chill or doing an 18,000 step skincare routine. It's whatever you feel like. Can I get this necklace off my neck? Is that gonna be possible today? Yo, can you get off me? Thank you. Let's go find my ring. I had to like take my ring off because my dog kept trying to eat it. Oh, I feel so better now. Okay, so I I do shift right now since I don't have like a main job anymore. I totally forgot that I had some order to do and I totally spaced and their order was supposed to be picked up like literally an hour ago and I was supposed to give it to them like now. Like I'm at home and this place I was supposed to be at to get their order was is three minutes away so I wouldn't make it in time anyways. So I had to drop the order and this is the first time it's happened. I feel so bad right now. So, so bad. Also, I know can't do bad for your hair, but I bought it for a video and I'm just trying to use it up because I'm not wasting any product. I don't care how bad it is for my hair. I'm not wasting product. Yes. Now, this is part of your self care. Make sure you, because people always like include their skin in their self care and their body, which I get. I notice like a lot of self care videos neglect the hair. And like, this is my favorite. A good scalp massage. Oh yeah. You know what's really good? Giving yourself a scalp massage after you've had a ponytail all day. God. I'm not brushing my teeth yet because I still have to eat dinner. If you are at this point with me, go ahead and brush your teeth um, while your water gets warm. That's what I always do at least. Today I decided to get cute for you guys and I put on makeup because I wanted to be cute. That's why. Not for you. For me. Um, so I'm using cleansing balm. I don't really like to use makeup wipes just because they kind of are kind of rough for your skin. Using the cleansing balm, no matter what kind of brand it's from, is good for your skin. Some brands are kind of tricky with their balms, though, so be careful. So this one I'm using is from Inky List, my almost second favorite brand. My favorite brand is Spotless Choice. Turns out like this. Rub it in. It's a little more liquidy with the heat of your hands, and then you just melt your makeup off. Do I look pretty yet? You wanna get a guy? Take your makeup off in front of him. Oh yeah. 
And this is me. Hello. For me, I don't really feel that much different when I take my makeup off. I feel like I still kind of look the same. You know, it's just a little bit less enhanced. Do I still look the same when I take my makeup off? I don't know if I do or not. Let me know, because I feel like I do. I don't look that different with makeup on. My eyes are really puffy though. That's one thing that I try to hide, the puffiness of my eyes. Usually I do like a double cleanser, I like use my balm and then I use another cleanser. We good. We good. I just want to talk to you guys for a second. How have you guys been? Because I honestly haven't talked to you in the longest time. And I feel so bad about it because I was so excited. I filmed like so many videos over the past few months and I hate them all. But I decided that I'm not going to like stop myself from posting anymore. I'm just going to, if I don't, even if I don't love it, I'm still going to post it because like it's going to help me grow in the long run. Like not even, I barely start to edit some of them. Like I know I don't like it already, so I don't even edit it. But like I need to practice on my editing because I want to get so much better than what I am right now. And I'm going to because you guys deserve that. Ugh, I'm breaking out. Not my period though, so my breakouts did go down. But my lip area, like right here, and my forehead and my cheeks make my highest breakout points, especially my cheeks. My cheeks are like the highest area and my, my cheeks and my forehead, the most area I break out. And I don't know what that means. I think it means like stress, right? If you break out the area you're stressed. That makes sense. I know I'm stressed because, woof, boy howdy. Well, this was fun, guys. Thank you for joining me on this whole hot girl fall routine. And honestly, you can do anything you want to be hot. You can dye your hair every three seconds. That's hot. And you can wear the most sexiest clothing you think you own like to me my sexy clothes is like skin tight i like skin tight clothes i like clothes that show my stomach i like clothes that show the goods okay i like clothes like that other people might like clothes that are more less revealing how about that um to other people it's like that sexy and honestly on some people that looks that looks hot that looks good but on me i look good I look like a potato sack. And I'm not with that. I barely have a shape. So if I wear like baggy clothes, there's nothing. There's nothing there. And I want something to be there. Or at least the illusion of something there. You know? If I wear clothes that show it. Um, but other people might not like that. And whatever you think is your hotness is your hotness. That's that. There's no other way to put it. There's no certain where you can look and if you want to be hot thank you guys for tuning into this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i enjoyed talking to you guys i missed you guys so much but if you guys didn't enjoy it you know what i'm gonna say you know what i'm gonna say you watch youtube um subscribe down below watch this next video whatever this video is comment down below any other things you can't comment dm me on instagram i do answer my dms unless it's weird robot people or creepy guys sending me pictures of their dingling that's not fun follow me on tiktok I'm gonna be a whole lot more active on there. Like this video if you liked it, or dislike it if you didn't like it, so I know if you don't like it, then I won't do it again. Love you guys. Bye. Mm -hmm. Let's ride. <laughs> like I'm at a freaking motorcycle gang or something, what the heck? Let's ride. Girl, go to therapy. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-